My name is Dirk Durham. It had been a lifelong dream for me to kill a mountain lion behind a pack of hound dogs. In 2021, I met some new friends. Bradley Dammerman, Tyrell Funk, and Tim Johnston. These men, with the help of Bradley's dogs, led me on the hunt of a lifetime in north central Idaho's thick evergreen forests. I was lucky enough to tag out on a giant mature tom. And now, it's time for Jason Phelps to have that same opportunity. Hey guys, we're in Idaho looking for mountain lions and we got a snowstorm that just rolled in. Our buddy Bradley up here said, hey, it might be a good time to come up and try to get a, a mountain lion for Jason. So uh, you might say, who the heck's Jason? How's it going? So lucky to draw one of the 70 non-resident hound hunter permits. And um, yeah, it's been kind of a, a real bad winter as far as uh, hound hunting goes. But uh, yeah, we got this weather moved in and so we're gonna come up this i don't even know where we're at dirk's navigating me we're gonna come up here and start looking for tracks and uh bradley went a different direction to to go look for tracks uh in a different area so we'll see what we can find well good news guys we have some very important news yeah we finally got down we've been up in the high stuff here for the last couple hours looking for tracks um can't get around real great without a side by side or a snowmobile. Came back down, got service, and got a text from Bradley that he found a, a big tom track. Um, he's about 30 miles uh, west of here, uh, down in the low country, and he's a little concerned. It's actually starting to warm up there. It's 34 now, and uh, he wants to, to let out on it before the snow melts. So he's going to actually let the dogs out, and we're going to go meet up with our buddies Tyrell and Tim uh, so they can bring us in on, on the four-wheelers. Uh, we don't know the area as well as they do and they kind of know the general vicinity. So we're gonna go meet up with Bradley here in a little bit. And, uh, with any luck, maybe they'll, the dogs will have a treat or uh, maybe they'll still be a chase by the time we get there. Phelps, what are you doing? Why are you driving so fast? Don't kill us, you're from Washington. You don't even know how to drive in snow. Well, you guys got this dry snow. Actually, today's not dry snow, it's pretty wet, but. I'm a pro at this wet snow we get one day a year, every other year. I don't believe you. What are you doing, Phelps? Put my bino harness on, getting ready to jump on the four-wheelers and go look for some hopefully big, not bobcats, not house cats, but cougars. Also known as mountain lions, also known as pumas. Well, thank you for that biological lesson. Yeah, you're gonna get an education here today. Phelps, you should come over here and help this guy. I know. <laughs> I'll probably just slow him down and get in the way. How's it going? Oh, you, who's this guy? It's me again. The old cat man, huh? No, I don't know about Bradley got the jump on me today. You're kind of the lucky charm, it I seems know. like. Oh, it's the shirt. It's the shirt. You got your same, oh, yeah. You, <laughs> same old shirt we had on uh, in my cat hunt. Yep. Awesome, awesome. Yeah. I'm gonna build the bow. Phelps, did you put that on with the pipe wrench earlier? No, but it's like it doesn't really want to be stuck to one or the other, so <laughs> just leave me alone here. Do you even have broadheads on those? Oh yeah. I Look. Or, I bet I pretty sure you don't just Look, oh. An iron wheel. Let me see here, hold on. That looks like a cat killing broadhead. I kind of pictured you for one of those guys that put those suction cups on their arrows. <laughs> Catch and release? Yeah. I can. No, we're going to go see if we can't run a cat down real quick here before it gets dark. It's going to be nice and warm, I'm sure. Put some gloves on before I get going though. 
I can at least pretend to be tough. Good girl! So we've been hunting a different ridge for most of the, the day and uh, Bradley cut a good track over here and let out on it and uh, sounds like we got, he's got him treed down there it's about what, 200 yards straight down? <laughs> so we're gonna head down there and, and see what he's got there. Heading to the cat tree right now. It's incredibly steep, very vertical. Navigating the cliffs. Don't want to get cliffed out, so we're picking our way down here real easy. You can hear the dogs barking. Well, we got a lion treat here for Phelps, and we're just trying to find the best way to get a good shot at it. It's pretty high up there and lots of brush in the way, so we're just trying to figure out which way to get the best angle at it. But we'll see. We want a perfect shot. We don't want a you know, chance wounding it without killing it, so we'll take our time here and figure it out. We didn't have a very good shot and the damn thing got down out of the tree here. Now we're chasing again.
Yeah. Is it loaded? Yeah. You can't hold it back? Yeah. Here, get over here where you can video again. Yeah. Ready? No, I gotta get my pistol up. Okay. You guys ready? No. No. Tell us when. Everybody ready? Yep. Shot. Get it again, Jerry, if there's no dog. Roll off the backside. Come here, come here. Help, help, help. Oh, we shot, Good job. I hope you hit record, because that'll be the coolest video ever. As soon as he backed up there, I'm like, he's safe. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Good job, buddy. Thank, Thank you, Ty. Beautiful oh, yeah, shoot. Boys. Come here. Cool. Thank you, Dirk. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Holy cow, I don't think I've ever seen, seen a video like that. What do you think, Phelps? We got a little more excitement than we a little more excitement than we bargained for there with uh, we watched this cat come right at us. Bradley could tell on his Garmin. We watched him walk up and we saw him pick this beautiful rock up and we all he knew he was gonna bay up up there and so we went, we went into you know, fast mode and made a good shot on him. I'd switch from the bow to the rifle, but what can you do there? We don't want any dogs hurt. Thank you, man. That's, that, you couldn't dream of that up any better. I mean, really. I, mean I wish you could have done it with the bow like yeah. you wanted, but I was a little nervous of him. Because no, he was parking, pouncing on one. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, I, I, know, like, yeah, I was too. I, just, I was here yeah. pretty quick. I think he had full intentions of getting in the dog fight. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he was. He's done the he, best. Well, and they'll drag a dog right off the top of that, you know. With him. Yeah, for sure. Heck yeah. Woo! That was, that was quite the adrenaline rush there when he jumped out of the tree. Did one of you guys touch him when he was backing down? He, he went right over my head. <laughs> like this far. I thought he was going to fall right on. <laughs> that was something. Oh, from the tree, yeah. Yeah? I know it. Dang, dang. That was something. I thought he was going to go down the hill and he decided to come yeah. right over. I know. It. I mean, you couldn't dream of that. Like, he's beautiful. Man, he's got a real pretty gray face. That yeah. cat of mine had a real gray face, too. Had what? Had a real gray face. He's still got a little gray in his face. Must have had a little bit of the spine going uphill, and that's yeah. what knocked him down yeah. into the lung. Steep it is. <laughs> that was a good shot. I wondered how Phelps did under the pressure. I saw pretty good. There was some talking, like squeeze the trigger, don't jerk this thing. Like, oh. just, and then I'm like, yeah, everybody's open sights are different. Like, are you dead level? Are you high or low? Like, I didn't want to ask any dumb questions. Oh, yeah. oh. No, what a in their mouth. What is that, Mal? He'll be good eating. Oh. You can bet this dog. baby's ate some milk. <laughs> yeah. A few deer, a few elk. A lot of deer. A lot of deer. The deer appreciate it. <laughs> this, this is my lucky cat hunting shirt. I've had it for 28 years. And it's been on almost every cat hunt I've been on. And that was a lot. It's pretty much a lucky charm. I'm, I'm rolling with the lucky shirt. I don't Phelps, know what happened. where was that thing sitting when you shot? Like on this uh, relative from where we are right He's now. He's one yard away and about 20 yards up. He was made up on the point of that rock when I shot from the other side. The only and cool, then bailed off this side. The, the only cool, uh, cool thing after the shot, he just dogs get face fell face. off of here. And well, we, it out stoned out him for a second, not, for about two that, seconds, and then oh, he yeah, got I, up I, and I'm, bailed I'm, and landed in this pile of brush. How heavy is that thing, Phelps? Probably 250. Oh, all of that. Yeah. I'm just real strong. <laughs> there was a big fiasco there for a little bit. Yeah. We, trying to figure out a shot when we got to Bradley that the cat was still treating. You actually said it bailed in between us getting here and the tree we got to. Yeah. We were just following dogs. Right. Um, we're trying to find a shot at that tree. Just nothing we were comfortable with. The bow was either straight up in the air or was too far a brush. Well, mm -hmm. then he decided to back down the tree. Yeah, and, uh, fast. And we were all away from the dogs. So we finally got the dogs turned out, and then that thing ran down the river or creek and came right back to us, right by us. Mm -hmm. And we got to watch him slither under us. You know, you always think a cat's sprinting everywhere. This right. thing just methodically was oh, crawling yeah. through. And then 
ended up on this rock right behind us and you could just see him back Snapping. back and then we all said that he's gonna bay up and yep sure yeah was, and uh yeah i know you i know that you had your bow and stuff but thank you for making a good clean shot that's yeah, yeah. kind of one of those things yeah but uh, uh, you know it I, you don't want to get your dogs hurt and so you know at, at that time bait up cat might as well grab the gun it's it, and in my opinion this take it for what it is when you got a tree cat it, right. the mechanism when people that go kill with a bow it's like it's you didn't it's not like harder to do it with a bow than it is with a rifle right it's exactly. just the weapon you're choosing to kill it with at that point yeah you're 100 um, right so it's right. like i i didn't i don't you didn't care any, no know, i didn't really care so no and, you know all the dogs i think when you came around the corner, was he stoned or dead already? He was, or was dead he, as can be, and, it, I, and I think all three dogs had a hold of him, so it was a good thing he was yeah, dead. Yeah, he was dead, dead. Because if yeah. he would have been wounded, that wouldn't have been good. But yeah, but yeah, yeah no, yeah. that was a nice show we got there. Um, yeah, um, yeah I, I'd rather it be in the tree just for the dog safety, but hey, we got him and all the dogs are yeah. safe. And, um, yeah. A heck of a shot, man, Thank under you. pressure, and you've just been high. This ain't... No, flat <laughs> ground, you know, you know, you were breathing hard, I'm yeah, sure. Yeah. I know I was. It was steep. But yeah, I just uh um no, I appreciate you no. you making a good shot. No, it's been, just, gosh, fun. Yeah, I love yeah. hunting with you and the camera guy even. Yeah, yeah, yeah the jokester behind the camera. Yeah. Yeah, wait till everybody sees what else I've been recording. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, oh, no, Cam and, and Tyrell of yeah. course. Thank yeah, you for all awesome. your guys' help and we just uh we made it happen and uh yeah, we were split up and and uh, you know to cover more ground because the snow was melting fast. But yeah. I luckily had cut this just, one and called, got a hold yeah. of you guys, and it just in the nick of time. I mean, yeah. there, you can see there's no snow. Yeah, this weather just yeah. hasn't cooperated for us at all. No, all winter, you know, you 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 get the tag, mm -hmm. you know, one of the seventy, and then yeah. you just don't get a, a winner at all to hunt. And it's, it was right. getting kind of frustrating. And then, you know, us both going to trade shows and yeah. basketball and everything going on, we just couldn't put it all together. And so we took advantage of this little window and it, it worked out. And it paid off, you know? Yep. And yeah, your buddy Dirk, I don't know. What do you guys think? You got him beat? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I, when I said that earlier, I was just kind of fooling, trying to mess with Phelps. Um, yeah. I don't know, but he's beautiful. Yeah, he's beautiful. Tall. It's a pretty uh, cat. They were both dandies, but this yeah. is, this is a, a nice cat yeah. too. They're both nice yeah. cats, and that's the ones we want to kill. I always let the females go. Yeah. Um, you know, I know some people kill them all, but they, as long as they're managed, yeah. you know, I mean, you know, this thing's sunk its teeth into some milk and deer, but you know, as long as we're, they're managed, you know, and there's not too many of them, but enough to, you know, hunt, you know, because, I mean, if we didn't have a few lines, we wouldn't have good dogs. Yeah, yeah. we got to be training them all the time and stuff, so, yeah. Um, but anyways, yeah, yeah, I know it's, uh, you know, worked out. So. No, appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. you bet. Yeah. Yes, sir. I thought you said you were good with a bow. <laughs> Why'd you use a gun? You Go. said, you told me you could shoot a cat anywhere. Well... <sighs> Do we need do we need uh, Mori Povich to come in here and get the light? They determine that I mean, was a we, lie. We we videoed it. We don't even need. We have well, video proof. My good buddy Bradley and I don't blame him one bit. Gets nervous of his dogs, and I get extra nervous for his dogs. Like make perfect shots, and a lot of times you don't get follow up. So the shot just was rough, and and the one good shot I had was straight up and down. So I don't know. I'm making excuses, but I'm glad that it worked out this way. No dogs got hurt. So I'm gonna take Dirk's joke to me and turn it into a an emotional story <laughs> on all uh, all the dogs are safe cute sound. look at them they're sleeping and these dogs all get to go back to their kennel and sleep tonight without a vet bill <laughs> i like that cue the sad music <laughs> <laughs>
wait to hear from you. You know how they get up and they back up against rocks and bay up and they're gonna just start swiping it? He backed up to a rock and I had to shoot him off the rock with a gun instead of my bow. Block guy still through and through and through. And uh, but he'll also be the first one to give credit where credit's due. Ooh. And he'll talk tell you that Mallory will outdo any dog he's ever had. Oh yeah. People always say, What's it like to hunt with Phelps? I'm like, well, if you like hunting with a jerk, threw my pack down the mountain. From way up there? He kicked it from way up there, rolled all the way down here. <sighs> Can't trust that guy. Good thing he pays me to be his friend.